Hi guys, welcome to another video on my YouTube channel. Um, thanks for tuning in. Um, in this video, I'm going to do an unboxing of uh, the new CNC controller hardware that I just got in. Um, standing right here on my bench, it's from Eating CNC. Uh, I know it's been a while uh, since I posted the last video on YouTube, but uh, it's because of some private stuff that was happening in the past and also due or because of the project planning uh, of the community project because now it's uh, it's at the point where it's really time consuming i have to take care of stuff and yeah but if you guys stay tuned uh, on the youtube videos or on uh, the instagram posts that i make uh, you guys always will be up to date and there's a lot more coming in the future um, for this project and uh, yeah but you guys will see it if you follow me and uh, subscribe to my youtube channel or subscri subscribe to my instagram and yeah but now just let just let's have a look uh, inside the package it's uh, pretty amazing what's inside there okay so this is how it's packaged um, first thing just the ethernet cable um, that they sent with it then first let's go through all those small boxes this one is the CNC 760 access breakout board um, just let me undo the packaging This one is the breakout board for uh, connecting all the axes to the main um, uh, controller board. So as you can see here, uh, you also can use it for 3D printing where you have multiple uh, extruders and of course uh, the six axis outputs. Uh, next one is the UIO 10 breakout board or yeah it's a breakout board um, this is a board that I just ran across uh, by watching some YouTube videos and I thought by myself this really is a nice nice board because what you can do with this board is you can connect several um, buttons or switches or hand wheels encoders to it and um, operate the software so you really if you have a touch screen on your system you really do not have to use um, a mouse or a keyboard to operate the software you can program or you can set up the software where you can set each button uh, to a different operation uh, or function so this is a really nice feature um, I'm going to use it in my uh, community project where I want to make an, an operator panel or a CNC controller panel for it so I really don't have to use uh, any keyboards or mouses at all so it's just a clean looking setup um, next one this is uh, the UI 10 DIN ray mount this is just the, the enclosure for the UI 10 breakout board um, this one accepts uh, the breakout board and then mounts onto a DIN rail pretty nice to have keeps it all clean next thing is the CNC 760 breakout board this is the second breakout board that goes on top of the 760 main board um, let me just see this is where you hook up all your uh, ins and outs or IOs um, which are necessary for the CNC machine uh, like homing switches um, IOs, everything what you just can imagine. So, pretty.
pretty nice quality. Um, wow, this actually really is a really nice quality. Man, it's nice. Yeah, so there's this one. And what do we have here? The thin rail mount for the 760. Looks the same as the small one for the UIO, just a bit bigger. You get the idea. And now to the main player of the whole setup. This is just so freaking nice. This, oh man, I really can't wait to, to wire this thing up and get it all running. This really is going to be awesome. Um, yeah, here you have it. This is uh, the CNC 760 controller board from Eating CNC. Really nice quality, all clean. Wow, this really, this truly is awesome. Yeah. Of course, Ethernet connector. Pretty nice stuff. Uh, by the way, this video is sponsored by Eating CNC because they um, they wanted uh, to support me with the community project. So yeah, thank you for sponsoring or supporting me, Eating CNC. Special uh, shout out uh, to Alfred Boss. Um, really nice guy at Eating CNC. It helps me out a lot. Um, if you have questions about uh, eating things or how to connect stuff or how to program stuff in inside the software uh, you always can call him uh, he always has an answer so yeah it's pretty nice uh, to have someone like like them on on my project and it really helps me out a lot so expect uh, to see more of the hardware in um, future videos because I'm going to make it a detailed video series uh, on how to connect it all up and how to set it up in the software. So yeah, it's going to be a lot of content, but also a lot of awesome content. So yeah, guys, stay tuned for this uh, and we will see us in the next video. Thank you for watching.